hi guys and welcome back to my channel so i wasn't going to bother doing a video on this but i thought just to give you guys some insight i guess on um what kind of things you get in pr packages and stuff like that i will video this one for you um this is my pr package from w7 um it, it sounds like there's a lot of stuff in there um but don't always expect that like you can just be have one item or stuff the the best thing to do is not expect anything really and then if anything comes it's a surprise isn't it um but yeah yeah i look a mess i haven't really brushed my hair today i'm still in my pajamas um i'm just having one of those days today it's absolutely boiling i've had to turn the fan off because it's really loud um <laughs> but yeah i am gonna go ahead and uh let me just cut the cellar tape off of it and then i'll open it with you okay so we have opened it a bit now so i can open it properly can we just talk about the packaging first how lush is that packaging absolutely love it it's all over as well which is i absolutely love that um you can actually buy mystery boxes um by w7 I think they do them on their website. Um, they're I think they're like twenty pound, but you get like a full face of items in there. So honestly, it's it's worth it. <laughs> Watch me struggle to open this now because I have taken the salad tape off, so technically it should be easy. I got one side up. I've missed some salad tape in my. Oh dear. This is going uh this is going well okay we got that so let's open this okay wow there is a lot a lot 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 of stuff in here okay so we have this W7 Matte Dreamer Loose Powder. Classy Cameo. Yeah, it looks nice. I will be, obviously, I'm, I'm going to be testing all these products out anyway. I have actually already got one of these. Um, they're amazing. It's, it's like the um, Hula. It's a dupe of the Hula uh, Benefit bronzer but it's it's just as good and it's like a fraction of the price let me try and open it no i even tried using my mouth it won't open yet so we have a hula oh oh now that's nice i'm guessing these are meant to be a dupe of the huda lipsticks maybe is it open? No. It doesn't open. I've got to break the seal here, but that's the colour. Yeah. My camera's not very, um, I don't think it likes me today. Let me re read what it says. It's heartache. That's what shade it is. And we have another lipstick, which is a red. The first one was more of a pinky colour. And this one is Bond Girl. Oh, I like that. I like that name, Bond Girl. Okay, I am so excited to try these. I love glitter. You guys know how much I love my glitter. Um, yeah, I love glitter. Definitely be using. I'm going to be using all of this stuff anyway to do a look, um, and obviously to review the items. Okay, so we got some primer. It's Glow Prime. I actually think I've got this. Not 100% sure, but I think I might have it. Um, but yeah, lovely primer. And then, oh, we have another one of these, which is a more of a nude colour. I love a nude lip. I really do. And this is in the shade Exposed. So it's kind of like naked, isn't it? Naked colour, so it's a nude. Uh, let's have a look. What's this? 
next we have this W7 Mega Matte Lips, um, which is obviously a mega matte lipstick, maybe liquid lipstick. It's Asta La Vista. Apologies about that, guys. My camera decided to run out of memory. Sorry, my phone even. So, I've managed to open these for you. So, this one, the nude colour, is this shade. Which is absolutely gorgeous. Um... It actually smells so good as well. They smell kind of like sweets, I guess. Um, and this is the red one. Which again is really, really pretty colour. I actually don't normally use lipsticks. I use the liquid lip stuff normally when I do looks this is the pink colour that's gorgeous I love that colour so that's them sorry this video is going to drag a little bit let's see what else we have we have this which is the W7 Lash Tastic Mascara it's false lash, false, false lash effect mascara. So that looks good. Oh, we have two more lip products here. We have this, which again is the Mega Matte Lips, which is the liquid lipstick. This one is in the shade, where are we? Not where are we? This is in the shade Sinful. It looks a really gorgeous colour. And then we have a nude one. Um, and this one is in the shade 2 Bob. Okay, what else do we have here? Ooh, what's this? We have this. Eye Eye Captain, which is a liquid eyeliner. I love a liquid liner. This I'm, I'm probably going to use like all the time. Um, but yeah, that looks really good. You get quite a lot as well. Um, okay, so let's uh, have a look at these. So, let's open this one. Blech. Sorry guys, I tried to open it with my mouth and <laughs> I didn't like it. Where have I put my scissors? Uh, I'm going to have to cut so much out of this. Um, I, you know how much I love my editing and I'm going to have to edit it so much. Okay, sorry guys, it won't let me cut with that hand, so I'm going to have to cut with this hand. There you go, that's much better and quicker. So, we have this, which is the W7 Nudification Palette. It says, wear it and bear it, pressed pigment palette palette de pigments presses so let's open this oh wow there are some absolute beautiful colors in there wow so yeah i'll do um a nude look i could do a nude like nude eye look i guess and Let's have a look at this other one we have in here. Okay, guys, so I have already got this. But, hey, I don't mind another one. This palette is beautiful. Um, let's open it and have a look. Check out those colours. How beautiful. They're gorgeous. And what a palette as well. Look at it. Yeah, like look at the look at the size of the mirror. You can see me. Um <clears throat> that is such a pretty palette. And this. This I love this as well. Look the squares. I love 
I really do. In all fairness, their packaging is really, really good. So guys, that was all the items. I mean, in a PR package, that's that's a lot, a lot of stuff to give me. Like, I'm quite shocked. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14 items wow i got like i can do so much i can create so much with this i have got their foundations and stuff so that's a good thing um yeah their foundations are actually really good um sorry if my eyes look funky this the lighting um but yeah i am so chuffed with that i am gonna do a few looks i think with this stuff and yeah this cheer them on because they're, they're actually a really good brand for the price that you pay for the items the quality is pretty good so it's definitely worth paying for them um but yeah i am look so looking forward to doing some looks with this um i'm really excited and um, yeah, I think that's it from me today. I'm sweating. I don't know if you can see, I'm absolutely boiling here. Um, I, I literally feel like I'm on holiday. I'm <laughs> just boiling. Um, so yeah, I am gonna go ahead and create some looks with this. Now, if you are a content creator and stuff on Instagram or... Um, youtube or whatever like that things like that your social platforms um then if you actually want to um you, there's a brand that you really like you're interested in and you would like to have you know some um items from them or you know as pr or whatever um the best thing to do is email them uh you can do this on either Instagram or you can find the email address and just e email them on your email account. Um, and just explain what you do, um, explain that you're a content creator, stuff like that. Um, or if you review makeup, tell them that you review makeup. Um, because obviously if you do that, then they know that they get something back as well. You know, they're not just giving you the makeup for free. Because that, if you if that's what you want to do, if you want to do it just to get free makeup, don't bother. Because you have gotta be in it. You know what I mean. You gotta. You can't just take free makeup from people, and you know you've either got to give them a review or um, a tutorial, a couple of looks, because um, they've taken their time and money and given you some free items. So you you've got to like be fair and you know. You have to repay them in some way. Um, so yeah, just give them an email, explain, give them your um, Instagram profile, give them your uh, YouTube account, email or whatever, uh, what you call it, information. Um, and yeah, and if they have a place there, normally they'll get back, back to you, like if they've got places and stuff, or if they, if they are looking for collabs and stuff like that they, they'll let you know um sometimes it can take weeks it can take weeks for them to get back to you um but normally they they do actually get back to you so if if no one gets back to you in a week or a week and a half or whatever don't be disheartened because honestly they will get back to you and um, whether it's a yes or no sometimes it depends on how many followers you have and stuff but I mean, I have 2,000 and something followers on my Instagram. And they were kind enough to send me some items out. So, I will, like I said, I'll be doing some looks with these items. I will also be reviewing the products for them. That way, you know, if they're really good, then people on my profile or on my, like, this account here will know then, you know. So, it'll get them more custom um you can't just expect things for free 
that just doesn't happen um but yeah um if you were interested in stuff like that just email the companies normally um if you're in instagram sometimes you get companies with the like they're looking for collabs or looking for affiliates or whatever then sometimes emailing them people is a good idea because obviously they'll send you out a couple of bits but you'll have to again return the favor with giving them a review and you know doing a look with you wearing if it's like eyelashes or something wear the eyelashes and tag them in it because they get recognition then you know um like i keep saying you cannot expect free makeup for nothing you know what i mean you've got to you've got to be able to give them something back you know it's only fair really to do that um i don't know i think maybe if if you didn't do that then maybe they'd um they'd like talk amongst themselves like different brands and stuff and think well we sent her that out and they didn't get anything out of it and then the other ones would be like oh yeah we did that as well so you don't want to be like a blacklisted person if that is a thing you don't want to be that you want to be you know supportive of the brands and companies that send you the items out um yeah so this obviously all of these items that i've showed you here today were gifted um from w7 but like i said i'm giving them a honest makeup review i will not lie because obviously if i lie about stuff then if i say oh my god it's really really good and then you guys try it and it's not then that's going to look bad on me so i will be honest in what i say and they understand that most companies most brands want you to be honest um you know they want you to so they they know what to make better and stuff like that um but yeah i'll be doing a review and a couple of makeup looks out of all the items that i have um my mouth is so dry sorry for sticking my tongue out but i'm very dry um i just thought i'd, I'd let you guys in because like when I first started doing makeup stuff, I was so intrigued. I was like, like, what do I do to, you know, because it's, it's how it helps you because you get to put content on your platform and it helps them because you're advertising, you know, the company. So when I first started, I, I had no clue, not an idea. Absolutely not. Um, until one influencer on um, Instagram let me know. I I don't want to mention her name just in case cuz you know but she she helped me out a lot and she I heard that she she does help out a lot of people no fairness um if she lets me I'll I'll put her name on here but I'm not promising anything but um yeah sometimes that's good if you if you are stuck and you don't know what to do even like messaging your influencers or people that have like I don't know like 12,000 followers or something like that message them because they've been through this process themselves you know everyone starts off here um so yeah give them a message and uh, most of the time they're really happy to help which is nice because you do get the odd people that are really like bitchy and find it a bit of a competition doing stuff like this which is like really stupid um but yeah most of them are really really nice so it's worth asking i'm gonna go now guys because i am tired of speaking and i need to wash my hair i need to um i don't know drink a gallon of water or something and yeah i will be posting the next videos that you'll see will probably be me posting up looks of um this w7 makeup and reviews of the items so i'm gonna go now guys i hope you have an amazing rest of the week i hope you had a really good bank holiday and i shall see you all soon Mwah. bye